Burn. Can't look at Randy Orton slithering. Oh, watch, out, watch, out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Hey, whoever said, hey, on me, whoever was sitting there play fighting with me, you the fucking homie, my nigga. I love fighting. I just knocked everything over on my desk. Don't worry about it. You know what I'm saying? We got Shalominati on the TV. We got Omar making the video. We got another banger, baby. I'm gonna put the food aside real quick. Thank you, no more to come. God, don't worry. I'm back with a Vinny. Got a California burrito from this little Mexican spot. I forgot the name, so I'm gonna pop it up on the screen right here. Okay. So I, I just want to eat and talk to y'all, bro. Like for real. Um. Honestly, let me turn this light off so I can look brighter. There go. So it is a nighttime little thing. Um. I'm editing on tonight, at a specific night, the date. Fuck it, I'll pop it up right here the day of this recording. Um, damn. You got hella chips and sauce, and they get bitch, bitch kind of hot, so it might be fresh. It might be fresh, y'all. Might. Keyword, might. We're going to try some of that in a second, man. I'm hungry as shit, so if I'm going to open this, I'm going to eat it. Show me some prayer. Good. So we got the California burrito. Ooh, let me show y'all this bitch right here. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Make sure y'all can see it. That's the cheese sauce on top of it, y'all. Um, everything inside there. I got everything in there besides sour cream, so vegetables and all that other shit. I got everything inside there except for uh uh so sour cream. I wasn't fuck with the sour cream. So let's go ahead and eat my nigga. Honestly, I wanna take a different approach to this vid. My nigga been good. This shit low-key good. I hope my niggas is good, bro. Mindset right now. I want more. I want more for myself. I want better for myself. I appreciate all the love and support we've been getting. Honestly, um, it's fucking crazy to me, man. Um, I'm a forever humble, my nigga. That's why y'all expect a nigga to be all excited. Damn, I'm getting rice and shit. That's where I got You're in the rice here, man. Dude, we didn't use a spoon for this shit, too. We had to use both. A spoon and a fork. Yeah, man. I honestly... Honestly, hope my niggas is good, man. 
me. But I'm just living life. Making Mickey Big Boy plays off the camera. Think about y'all niggas, man. How much, you know, the true small group of individuals that really fuck with me. It's crazy, my nigga. It's crazy how far we came at so small. It's crazy the up and downs I faced through all my whole entire life. And I'm just here to let y'all know I'm here to stay. I mean, I'm forever. Let niggas, these niggas is limited, bro. They only could do certain things because they don't got nobody that really fuck with them. They only could say certain things. They only could be certain things. But I'm limitless. You know what I'm saying? I'm forever, bro. Everything I'm gonna do, everything I do is gonna be beautiful. Everybody I fuck with gonna be limitless. You with me, you in the one team. For anybody say anything, I ain't talking about no motherfucking talking about no materialistic shit, bro. I think I'm talking about let's talk about some real shit, nigga. Us as people, bro. Us. As human beings, my nigga. What are you without this materialistic shit, bro? What if you got a million dollars and nobody else is on this earth? You know what I'm saying? Like, that would change your perspective, my nigga. Fuck the eyeballs, man. Fuck the people that's counting you out. Focus on the personal growth, bro. Because the post the personal growth is that little ass seed. And then by years and years and months and months, weeks and weeks of experiences, my nigga, it's going to sprout into a little tree. It's going to go to a medium tree. Then it's going to go to a fucking huge ass tree. That's why I got that. Hold on. My hand dirty. I got nothing right here. That's why I got, that's why it's a tree on my protection crystal, my nigga. Growth. Growth is the key to everything. Bro, I'm not going to have the same mindset I have now when I'm 30. I'm going to be completely, what they completely different. I'm going to look at life completely different than how I look at it now. Well, I was saying, though, bro, that shit was this cause about to piss me off. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna have the same mindset I have when I'm 30, bro. It's all about growth. Look at this in this perspective, right? Who are you when you by yourself? Who are you when you alone? You still, you still, just, you still, you, right? So what makes a difference when you come in a room being yourself? Rather than coming in a room being by yourself, I mean coming in a room being somebody else. That'll fuck you up, right? Now I guess it's even deeper. You come around by yourself. You have nothing to hide. You have no image. Because when you say one lie, 
you got to make 30 more lies to cover up that one lie. You come in being yourself, you being honest, you got a hundred, you got one truth and to tell them a hundred more truths. So end of the day, choose who you want to be. You want to be you or you want to be something that you're not because you date somebody like that, that second person way better than they like your original self. And I feel like regardless if people hate your, your original self, one thing people can say about evil people, at least they being them. The people that try to act like they're good and act like they're friendly, they nice. I feel like an evil person is rather be in they self than be something else. It's more, it's more authentic and real than you. Because you trying to act like you like people in real reality, you could relate more to that evil person. And there's nothing wrong with that, bro. Let me tell you the most beautiful thing about life. What makes life so interesting is we got billions of brains and they all think completely different. Let me say that one more time. Let this sink in. We have billions of brains on earth. Not in country. Not in Foot Locker, nigga. Billions of brains on earth. And every single one, every single person on this earth thinks completely different. Successful, poor, middle class, high class, but not really, not really rich. All think people that's not even civilized yet all think completely different bro that will fuck you up bro when you really let that shit sink in it will really mess you up because you like that nigga omar right nobody on earth think exactly alike nobody similar but not dead on alike. You know what I'm saying? I believe motherfuckers when they show you them the first time. Stop giving niggas benefit that. Oh, she's not gonna cheat on me. Oh, that's just her guy friend. How I feel about the shit, y'all. If y'all action Omar, if a motherfucker got the balls to cross you like that, if a motherfucker got the balls to cross you like that, I wouldn't even be dealing with that person, bro. It's a sign that they really don't respect you, bro, how you think they do. How they say they respect you, bro, seem like they don't really respect you, big dog. Not just me being a hunting with you. We're gonna try this. Oh, these chips here. Fuck around and get a little nachos in here. The chips here, let me try some of this sauce at all. Try some of the chips with the sauce. Bro, this shit tastes really fresh and spicy. I fuck with this sauce, man. This sauce is kinda of, this kinda of here though. This shit do kinda of here, I ain't gonna. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That shit buzz, my nigga. We gonna get the burrito. This burrito actually fucking hit. 
And I don't like cheese sauce. And the shit good as fuck. I'm gonna give this a real. If I go to this place, I won't mind getting this again. I'm gonna get this burrito eight, bro. This burrito is solid eight. It hit all that shit. And why the fuck would they put sour cream inside of this? Sour cream would have ruined this shit. This shit don't need no sour cream. Sour cream is overkill, bro. Like right, to me, bro, sour cream is like a number one thing. It's just like fucking nothing, bro. Enough. Niggas put sour cream on everything just for aesthetic reasons. As far as shit look, you ain't tasting no sour cream, my nigga. Watch out. If you could taste sour cream, then you got strong taste buds like me. I could taste sour cream, but a lot of people tell me they can't taste it. So they said, just only put this shit on there, bro. I'm done holding my niggas, man. I'm not going to give for a little kind of different vibe. Like a relax. Kind of an empty mind. Just because I do got an empty mind right now. I'm not really thinking about nothing. Just relaxing and enjoying my company, man. Um, yeah, I'm finna eat and get these videos out for y'all. I just wanted to make y'all a little talk and eat session. Try this little spot. Spot right here. Again. That's what he is. Pretty good. I get the chips in. I get the chips and salsa. It's also fresh. Chips is fresh. Give it a solid like six, seven. They don't really got no must have it again type taste you know what i'm saying so six seven it's not bad beard though eight so overall i'm gonna get a spot like a seven and a half yeah i'm gone man make sure i like comment subscribe now check this out right here 90 percent of y'all watching my shit and like 10 percent of y'all is only subscribed you know what i'm saying 90 percent is not subscribed 10 percent is subscribed so make sure y'all run that up for your boy hit that sub button bro obviously something keep dragging you back so go ahead and support for your boy man omar go